the Four Leaf Face Off. Here we will get to see just how much we know about St. Patrick's Day. I am your host, Rachel Woo! Keller, this morning. <laughs> we test out to see how much our anchors know about the Irish holiday. Today we have in corner one, Tracy Koenig, anchor of Daybreak. And in corner two, we have Eric Brill. How you doing? <laughs> Hailing from New York City. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we will begin today's show with our first question. Are you ready? We're ready. Do we have All a right. We're green. No, we you really don't. Okay. All right, number one. St. Patrick's Day observes the death of who? We have A, William Crossgrave, B, St. Columbia, C, St. Patrick, or D, Michael D. Higgins. Uh, I have absolutely zero clues, so I'm going A. William Crossgrave, okay. And what about you, Eric? St. Patrick just seems like it makes too much sense. So, you know, just for the sake of making too much sense, I'm gonna go with C, <laughs> St. Patrick. And ding, 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 we have a winner. The winner and the answer. Let's get the boys Saint going, here Patrick. we go. It's like somebody that Please. drove snakes out of there or something. Didn't he just drive Good the snakes job, out? Tracy. He drove snakes out, but That's I didn't one. know it was to honor his death. We're going to address that a little bit later mm -hmm. in the trivia. Now, here's a smart question Eric. two. Oh, smart Alec. Which color was Green. originally traditionally associated with St. Patrick? We mm -hmm. have A, blue, B, orange, C, green, or D, white. Green I'm seems not like gonna, it makes too much yeah, sense. Yeah, you say green because you have to go with the... No, 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 no. I'm gonna go blue. No, I want blue. Fine, then you, I'm wearing blue today. Fine, then I'm We're gonna go green. We're wearing blue for colon cancer. She's going blue, yes. I'm going green. Deal. All I right. Blue. Okay, Tracy is going with A, and Eric is going with C. Ding, 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 we have a winner. A, blue. You actually got it too. I'll give you that one too. We can so we're it. So we're tied up, we're tied up. Well, apparently it's two yeah. one. She, oh. she, she's giving me the benefit of the doubt. He really wanted blue. We can all both right. say blue, can't we? Two one. Two one. All, all right. right, all right. Next question. These two Irish foods are commonly oh, I know. eaten Chick-fil-A. <laughs> I know this one, I know this one. I think I know this one. Bread and butter, potatoes no. and stew. No. Whataburger and Chick-fil-A. Always, but no. <laughs> or corned beef and cabbage. Yes. You gotta go corned beef and cabbage. You can't pick what I pick. Okay, pick what I pick. I'm gonna pick the right answer. <laughs> it's corned beef and cabbage. Yeah. All right, you both got it. It is D, corned beef and Look cabbage. It's a butter world on a roll, TK. Crazy smart, crazy smart, I You guys you. are good. Are we tied up now? No. Nope, three, three two, two, three, three two. two. <laughs> All right, next no, question. No, you cheated stole my answer. Okay. Are you ready? You We're ready. What is the symbol of St. Patrick's mm. Day? We have A, four leaf clover, mm -hmm. B, Shamrock, which is also a three leaf clover, C, the leprechaun, or D, the Celtic triangle. Don't cheat and look at my answers over here. Eric. I'm gonna go with the triangle. Yeah, okay. That's what I want too. Oh, so now you're copying my answer. <laughs> it's the shamrock. The shamrock. Ding, ding, ding. We have a winner. B, shamrock. All right, now we are tied up. Three, three. Three, three. All right, let's bring on question number five. When was the first St. Patrick's Day parade? 1492. That's Columbus. Oh, yeah. Oh. Columbus. <laughs> All right, let's we have see. A, Boston in 1737, mm -hmm. B, Irish Town in 1800, C, Dublin in 1931, or D, New York in 1922. I got my parade. Mm. I'm gonna go. I'm. I'm Boston. saying New York. I'm going, Bo go Boston. Okay. Let's go Boston. I'll say All New right. York. Let's, Let's bring Dublin. up that answer. <laughs> what do we Silver have here? Says, Boston, Boston in 1737. Oh. Getting on a roll, boys Whatever. and girls. <laughs> Eric, he up cheated. four he three. Cheated. <laughs> All right, let's bring on that next question. <clears throat> Did St. Patrick, we were talking about this earlier, okay. banish snakes in Ireland? It's just a true or false answer. We have A, true, or B, false, yes or no? That's what the legend says, so I'm saying yes. I'm gonna go no, just to be a contrarian. And we have that answer, let's pull that up. No! Oh, St. 
two Look cats that, that didn't vanish. That's not true because I heard that it was true. So automatically they got your answer? <laughs> That's what everybody talks about, right? I know, it is That's a legend. Who's everybody? I don't know. The Everyone who's Irish. Dairy people. Well, did you know that snakes never actually were even in Ireland to begin because with? Because he drove them all out. <laughs> Obviously. Because he believes that she's It was she's, filled with snakes right. till St. Patrick got there. That's what I say. Snakes on a plane. <laughs> all right, we ready for the next question? Yeah, I'm ready. Mm -hmm. let's, let's Can we have like double or nothing grill. right here? No, no, no. We'll get there. All right. There are more Americans of Irish origin than there are Irish in Ireland. Yes. Is yeah. this true or false? Yeah. You can't answer. Yes. Yeah. True. I'm ding, here ding, to win. Ding. True. There are more Irish in the United yeah. States than there are in Ireland. Did you know that? No, but we guessed it. You guessed it right. <laughs> Six to four. Ooh. Come on, Trace. Six to four. Is it really six to four? Okay, yeah, we're going with that. Okay, next, which city in the United States famously dyes its main river green every year? We have A, Baltimore, B, Los Angeles, C, Beaumont, <laughs> or D, Chicago? I know the answer to this, do you? One, two, three, Chicago. Chicago. Ding, ding, ding! And we have your answer, it is D, Chicago, of course. Chicago famously dyes the river green. And we go into our next question here, number nine. The nature's would look really interesting if it was mm -hmm. green, though. Yeah. Let's do it. Nature's Start river. It. That's a tradition. Yeah. Damn, that's a lot of green dye, though. <laughs> that's a lot of green dye. J.D. Batten with the alligator garden. Oh, I'll right. Be too happy with that. J.D. Batten would be good. Hey, we need you to dye the river green. Good stuff there. Which city has the largest parade in the United States? A, Boston, B, New York City, C, Chicago, or D, Philadelphia? Mm, this is an interesting one. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say New York. No, I, I've never heard of, no. You're from there. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Philly. You're gonna go with my hometown. Go, yeah, we're gonna, so we got Philly, New York City. Could be so Boston, you got New York City. I'll, st I'll still take New York. All right, we have a winner. Let's bring up that answer. What That'd is it? Yes! B, New oh, York yeah. City. Oh, got Tracy. Some cracks in the armor now. Oh, All yeah, right. baby. What's Seven the score? to six. Seven to six. Hmm. All right, here we go. Make it a couple. Dun, hey, dun, dun. Hey, we've been right with every single question, one of the two of us at least. So we, That's we're doing true. That right. a good team, yeah. right? Very true, very true. All right, <laughs> and our final question. For two points? For two points. Thinking. <laughs> Let's see if I can pronounce this word correctly. <laughs> what? what? Is, is the name of what? <laughs> Let's bring up. Absolutely nothing. What we can decide mm. on. A, the name of a mean and nasty <laughs> leprechaun. B, name? the longest river in Ireland. C, the longest name of a town in Ireland. Or D, a prey you say before getting into a bar fight. The town one seems like it makes too much sense. It's not quite a sandboy push kinch get from job all statistical go go go. Oh good. But it's not that far off from that. So I'm gonna go with the longest town name that's in Ireland. I think you said it seemed like the most logical one. Yeah. I was gonna go with that, but since you're going with this, I'm going for A for the win. I hope, I hope both one of us is right out of this. You're going A, I'm going C. It's probably C, but I'm it's going A. I feel good. Folks, what do you think? Need a nasty what leprechaun. is Dada <laughs> Halia? Sounds like a really bad leprechaun. Really bad. <laughs> Let's bring up that answer. Hey, the it's longest a water name roll. of the town in Ireland. <sighs> and we have our winner. Show up. You cheated. Eric I'm Brew. You so Eric tough. Brew. Ding, 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 ding. Our winner. Now, Eric, are you even Irish? Are you? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. How much? Uh, Percentage-wise, I don't know, but I'm more Irish than I am anything else. Wow. Yeah. So, of course you would win. You know what? He didn't even tell us that he was Irish before the game. I think he's only Irish now. Anyway. anyway. Congratulations. Congratulations, Nicely winner. done. Nicely done. Welcome back to Daybreak. Thanks for joining us. Have a great weekend. Enjoy Slowly St. Patrick's Day. Ladies and gents. <laughs> Stop.